What's going on gamers? Today we are going to go over how to join a Starbound server. Before we get started, don't forget to like, subscribe, and click that notification bell to stay up to date on all future videos. After escaping your home's destruction on a damaged spaceship, your only choice is to beam down to the planet below to survive in the worlds of Starbound. You can choose from a variety of play styles by yourself or with friends to farm, explore dungeons, or build massive structures that tower over the world. You can even visit a whole universe on a Starbound dedicated server, which allows you to play through a story campaign and build your crew from the ground up. To get started, you'll have to know how to join, so let's go over how to do that today. Head into your Apex server panel and make sure that your Starbound server is online. From the main panel page, scroll down to the IP address port section and make sure to copy this address. Before you can connect, you will have to separate the server address into the individual IP and port. The numbers before the colon are the IP address and the five after is the port. First, launch Starbound on your computer and on the main menu, press join game and then create or select a character that you want to use. And in the prompt, enter the IP address in the first text field. And in the smaller one, you can enter the server's port. After that, press join server to begin connecting and start playing. Starbound will automatically save the address that you just used, allowing you to quickly reconnect to the server at any time. But every time you join a new server, the last address that you input is going to be the one that the game remembers for easy joining the next time. Now let's go over some common issues. If you get a join failed error, it means that the server isn't able to be reached. First, make sure that the server is online and functional, which you can check in the console on your panel. And if you're still having a problem, double check to make sure that the IP and port were entered and separated correctly. You might get a no such account error if you have never been configured on the server and you try to input a username. If you haven't been configured, you can just ignore these two prompts and connect normally. If you do have a user account set up, just make sure that both your username and password don't have any typos and try again. As long as you have the server's IP address, joining a Starbound game is super easy. Playing on a server gives you the chance to play with your friends or other players, giving a whole new experience to the game. So start exploring and build up your world. That's all for this one, gamers. As always, I hope you have lots of fun. Thanks for watching. If you want to see more great content like this, then subscribe or click these videos. Until next time, gamers.